we present Rome, a novel diffusion-based approach for robust human motion reconstruction. 3D human motion reconstruction from a monocular video has been extensively studied in the community. However, existing works still encounter many problems. Regression-based methods mostly do not reconstruct motions in the global space and struggle with body occlusions. Optimization-based methods are time-consuming and prone to local minima. What are the biggest challenges in this task? On one hand, many methods rely on noisy 2D key points causing motion jittering. On the other hand, humans undergo frequent occlusions when moving in 3D environments, leading to implausible motions such as foot skating. How can we address noise and occlusion simultaneously? To this end, we present Rome. By leveraging the iterative nature of diffusion models, Rome reconstructs high-quality motions in the global space, which is robust to both noise and occlusions, and more computationally efficient than optimization-based methods. Given a monocular video, we obtain the initial noisy and incomplete motion sequence with existing methods, and we aim to reconstruct the complete and plausible motion from that. The task is decomposed by two diffusion models, the trajectory net and pose net, to denoise and infill the global trajectory and local pose separately. The reconstruction is conditioned on the corrupted input, and a complete motion is obtained from that. However, the trajectory modeling ignores the interdependencies between the trajectory and body pose, causing some implausibility in the output motion, such as foot skating. To address this issue, we propose a flexible conditioning module, trajectory control, to capture the correlations between the trajectory and pose. In the trajectory net, as the clean pose is not available in the beginning, the trajectory is reconstructed conditioning only on the corrupted input. With PoseNet, a cleaner version of the trajectory and local pose is obtained. The pose encoder E is copied from the original trajectory net encoder and fine-tuned with other green parts frozen. Multi-level pose features are added to the trajectory net as the additional control, improving the reconstructed motion quality in the global space. Leveraging the trajectory control, we propose an iterative inference schedule for motion refinement. At the first inference iteration, the motion is reconstructed from the noisy and occluded input. In the following iterations, the trajectory net leverages the body pose and further refines the global dynamics conditioning on the prediction from the previous inference iteration. Based on that, the pose net refines the local body pose. The motion plausibility is iteratively refined by incorporating the trajectory pose interdependencies. Empirically, we find two iterations are already sufficient. Here, we present the results on AMAS dataset for motion denoising and infilling. Synthetic Gaussian noise is added to the input body, with lower body masked out for all frames. Compared with the baseline, which exhibits severe foot skating and implausible motions, our method produces more natural motions, with better reconstruction accuracy, more plausible dynamics for occluded body parts, and accurate foot-ground contact predictions. Besides motion and filling, our method also enables motion in between for the full body with noisy input when a certain percentage of the input frames are masked out. Here we demonstrate our results of motion reconstruction from real-life video input on PROX and EgoBody datasets. Compared with the baseline methods, our method are more robust to noise and occlusions in real-life scenarios and achieves significantly improved motion plausibility with visible body parts well aligned with image evidence. In summary, we introduce Rome, a diffusion-based approach for robust human motion reconstruction. We address the problem of recovering global and local motion by learning two models and conditioning them on available input observations. A flexible control module captures correlations between global and local dynamics, utilized within an iterative inference scheme to refine motion plausibility. Thank you for watching.